What's going on everybody? Um, it is day 10. Man, that's like a lot of days in a row of me just talking shit to this camera. But uh, if you're thinking to yourself, wow, Sean, you look particularly shitty today. You're right. It's because I woke up feeling pretty sick. I figured that's what's been wrong with me the last two days. Woke up with like pretty bad head cold, just like, pfft, like woke up, you know, when you just wake up, you feel congested, can't really breathe, chest is tight, everything, just glands are sore. Feel pretty shit overall. But, still gotta get these daily vlogs going because I made a promise and I keep promises. So, um, I'm gonna head to the gym in a little bit. I really, again, I don't wanna go. I just don't wanna train right now. I'm not in the mood. Like, I just, I just don't feel well. But I know once you get in, you start training and you start releasing endorphins, you'll feel better. But the only thing that's really making me not wanna go is the fact that it's leg day. Like, it's just unfortunate the way these leg days keep coming so fucking often. But uh, we're gonna go, we're gonna get it done anyway. Then I'm gonna come home, eat some food, you know what else am I gonna do? Then I have a haircut in town at quarter past five, so I'm gonna go into that. Looks like it's gonna last rain, just looking out the window there, so you don't mind me. But yeah, that's that's kind of the plan for my day here today. Um, yesterday's vidit, or vidit? That's, that's a mixture of video and edit, for anybody wondering, um, is, gonna be live at three o'clock so let me know did you guys enjoy that like edit style of video where it was like completely new style of editing for me I've never done an edit like that um, and would you like to see more professional style edits on this channel so for example I have people like offering to do workouts or like edits with me you know I go in I work out they film it they'll edit it for me blah 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 would you like to see something like that I think it would be pretty cool personally but if you don't want to see it I'm not gonna do it am I so let me know if people would be interested in seeing that. Um, probably would be pretty cool. But yeah, I'm gonna go get ready now for the gym and go train legs. Right, I'll see you in a bit.
last set just to burn it out and kill yourself with it. Wow. Cullen Fitness tip of the day that I totally didn't steal from Steve Cook. Keep your chest up on this. The difference in the squeeze in your hamstrings is ridiculous. I don't even know why. Steve said why, but I can't remember why. I just watched the video. But this is how it looks when you do it. This is on the leg curl. So, watch Curling this. those legs. Hips pressed in the pad. Heard it here first. Heard it here first. Unless you watch that Steve Cook video, in which case, I'm sorry, but like, you know. And you've already heard it. <laughs> Sickness catching up with me. I feel like shit again. It felt really good for a while now, I feel like shit again. But finishing strong with some abs, just doing some. Leg raise is super set with weighted cable crunches. Keep them abs, even though I'm like getting fat right now. Gotta keep your abs so. 10 or 12 reps. Let's go. So, just back from the gym there, and my god, do I feel like shit right now. Like, I am completely smothered, congested, feel horrible, but I still got it done. And what I wanted to talk about now, because it kind of segues nicely into this topic, is training while you're sick or training while you're injured, and should you do it, when you should do it, when you shouldn't do it, etc. So, for me, my general rule is if you have a temperature, like a raised temperature, like a high temperature, don't go to the gym. Stay at home that day, let yourself recover, recoup, go the next day. Take a hit that one day because if you train on that high temperature, you could put yourself then at risk, you know, to make it worse, blah, 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 and then put yourself out for a couple of days rather than just that one day. Now, if you have a cold like I have at the minute, like a bad head cold, anything like that, you know, like a, you're just not feeling great, you got a little bit of a pain, you know, sore shoulder, something like that, go train. Just don't be a bitch, suck it up and go train. That's honestly how I feel about that because a lot of it is your mindset again, you know, goes back to the mindset and do you want to, you know, if you're, if you have a cold, and you're like, oh Jesus, I have a cold, I can't go train, that's just looking for the first excuse as to not go and train, you know, that's, that's no good, it's the same, you know, I've been training injured for the past two and a half months, since I went on holidays, I've been training injured, you know, I've had the injury in my right shoulder, which is still not fully healed, and I've had the injury in my forearm, which is much worse than the injury in my shoulder, and it's still not healed, like I still cannot take any weight through my left hand. Like that's, you know, I've just, when I'm doing back, you know, you saw me doing back yesterday, everything I do is a hook grip because I can't take the weight. If I clench my fist like this, that hurts. Like that hurts my forearm right now. But I've still been training. A lot of it is just about, <coughs> excuse me, sucking it up, getting on with it. If you're a man, man it up. If you're a girl, girl it up because we're all about gender equality on this channel. But uh, no, seriously, if you're sick and if you're genuinely sick, say like you have, I don't know, diarrhea, a raised temperature, stuff like that. Don't go train, that's just silly. If you have a cold, something smaller, small little niggling injuries, go train on them. Chances are you're not gonna make it worse. Um, as long as you're sensible with your training and you know your body, you'll be absolutely fine. So, I'm just cooking up some food now, having steak, rice and peppers, the usual shit, guys. You know I eat the same thing every day. Going into town later for a haircut, as I said. I'm gonna have a burrito again today when I go in there. Wait until you see when I get back to college, people. I eat a burrito every single day in town with no regrets. So, yeah, I'll check in with you a bit. What is going on, everybody? So, I'm just home from town there. 
such a miserable, miserable day here in Ireland. Classic, classic weather. But I'm just sitting down to watch the football now. There's loads of football on at the minute. United are playing Northampton. Uh, score prediction, the way United are playing, I have no idea. Probably like 1-0 to Northampton in the 89th minute or something like that. Uh, then Madrid are playing Villarreal as well at the minute. Um, and then Atletico are playing Barcelona at like 9. So I'm just literally going to sit down and watch football for the rest of the evening. Um, but yeah, so probably going to finish the video up here because I'm not really going to do a whole pile else for the day. So if you like the video, usual shit people, leave it a like because you know, we just, we like likes. That makes sense, doesn't it? So um, comment if you want to comment something, I guess, and then subscribe if you're new as well. And I will see you tomorrow.